All right, there's only one number in the world that K could be in this equation, and you gotta figure out what that value is. It's quite simple, actually. You're just gonna break the left and right side up, and you're just gonna simplify everything down and over here. So you do need to have some prior skills where you know how to distribute this three to the K, distribute the three to the one, and then we're gonna combine our like terms. Over here, we're gonna be doing the exact same thing, and then I'll tell you what we do from there. So first and foremost, three times K, three times one, giving you three K plus three, Add the 11K. Now these are like terms 3K and 11K, so we're gonna add those two together right now to get 14K plus three. There's nothing to be combined with the constant. Over here, we're gonna do the exact same thing. We have a constant outside of a grouping symbol, and then we're gonna need to distribute to both of those. That's multiplication happening. Two times four gives me eight. Two times five is gonna give me 10. Don't forget to attach the variable to it. Just bring down plus three. Find out which one of these are common terms or like terms. That's gonna be your constants. Eight and three can be combined. We can't combine the 10K because it's got that variable attached to it. So eight plus three is gonna give me 11. I like to always put the variable term first. So 10K goes down first. The eight added with 11 is gonna give me, or excuse me, eight added with three is gonna give me, jumped ahead of myself, 11. Okay, so now what we have is we've got variables on both sides. I always recommend that my students get the variables to the same side first instead of the constants. Um, so 14K, we want to use an inverse operation. This is a positive term. So to get rid of it, we would subtract 14K to cancel it out, and that would push it to the right side. I think that's kind of a silly decision, however, because taking 14K away from 10K is going to give you a negative value. I always try and avoid the negative, so the route I would take here is taking away 10K because that's a positive 10K. Take it away, cancels it out. If you do it to the right side, we know we gotta do it to the left side. So take away 10K over here as well. 14 minus 10 is gonna leave me with 4K plus three. And by golly, we found ourselves into a two-step equation. If you're watching this video, you probably know how to solve your two steps. We're only two steps away. Get rid of this constant. Take it away, take it away. I'm gonna leave you with eight equals four K, divide by four, divide by four, K is equal to two. Study hard and good luck on your upcoming test.